What? That's not so, uh, me. I thought taking pictures of the condo, not you. Oh, Don't yeah. flatter yourself. Oh. Today is July 7th, 1995. And we're at the Condominios Pilar in San Carlos, Sonora, Mexico. And we are in room number 218. We're heading down to the beach. It's about 5.30. I'll tell you exactly. 6.19, is that right? Hold on. That's exactly right. It's 6.19. And uh, we're heading down to the beach to watch the sunset, to play in the water a little bit. Ready to go, guys? Here's a blocked view from the uh, of the estuary. Let me put the backlight on. I am the estuary man. Ready to go, Tony? I am the estuary man. Carry those down to the um, to the water, Nick, and you can put them on there. No. Oh shoot! Okay, here we go. Ready to go, guys? Yeah, we're ready to go. Well, let's go. See my shoes? These are what I use. And we used to shake our boots. Now we're going down the steps and we're almost there to be. This is where our condo is. What? It's my condo. There's Tom. Backlight, you probably can't see him, but that's him. Yeah. Tony, what are you doing with the fish tank, love? It's to use to put the stuff. Like if I catch a crab or something? Yes. I don't think I'll be able to catch a crab because it's... I notice, uh... I've water. seen two crabs so far on this trip. go out there because the uh, sprinkler system is on. The sun is still very bright, so I don't know how this is going to come out. too far.
apply the water is about 90 degrees. out there folks what will it look like in 10 years Tony? This is the condo. Our bedroom. Mary. Nickel Puss. Kitchen area. I'll keep this short because you have fresh cabria on the grill outside and I have to go turn it so I'll be back. Does Tony know how to play now, Nick? No, not really. He then only got two guys left. Well, oh, but you're still oh, learning. You're supposed to have that. So Hey guys, we got 10 minutes and then it's bedtime. See what I mean? Well, Tony, you know, when you play games, one person wins, one person loses. That's the way it works in checkers.
Benim için ne? Ne? Tell him to come in. Come in. That time is silly. Yeah. Tony, stop. Tell me about um, the waves today, guys. What did we do? We got to find, find or accidentally come and stay at this place. Go on tidal waves. Spring your... Spring your room. And even have fun because stay till high tide. That's the finest part. Emily sleeping. This is not the night of morning. I've got to get my brother and read the family and play the game. Backlight. And I am so scared. View from the condo window. Look at, look at, she's all fat. Look at the kids, they're all dressed up. And then look at Booga Booga. <laughs> Native. <laughs> look at a native. A, a, a native. A, a, a native. A native. Tony, if I have to tell you one more time to do that, oh, you're going to be out of here. Oh, Nick, are you reading her a book? What happened to that idea, Nick? Emmy? How's Emmy? How's Emmy? Good? Emmy, will you give Nick a kiss? Will you give Nicholas a kiss? Give Nick a kiss. And why do you say that? Because I want to see if you kiss. <laughs> nice kiss, Emmy. How about one more just to make it even on this
This is looking east. That's the estuary. There's the beach that's looking south toward Wymus. The view from our back porch. Tea? The shells. Well, obviously, but you want to say where you got them from and everything? Got them from the ocean lands. Got them from the ocean lands. Got them from the ocean lands. I thought we were. Sometimes they're good. These anti-cut spikes, water spikes, and oh, um, let's get Today's July 9th, it's about 3.30 in the afternoon. We just spent two hours snorkeling. Right, guys? Yep. And guys, just out of curiosity, and for um, the camera, tell me what you thought of it. Good what? Of snorkeling. Excellent. I stepped on a sea urchin. The first day, Tony stepped on a jellyfish. Today, I stepped on a sea urchin and stubbed my toe. That's why I have a band aid on it. Uh huh. And, and I am on level four. And uh, what about what did you find? What did you see when you were snorkeling? We saw like like eight hundred million trill. In a cabillion, bazillion, billion clams. And a cabillion, bajillion, carillion, billion, pickillion, brillion, brillion, killion. And we swam over sea urchins. What about fish? Have you seen any fish? Oh, 10 million, 8,000, billion, trillion, killion. Okay, Tony, could you put that and on? I saw, um, in this, in the exact same place, I saw 16 different, different, different types of fish. 16? Mm -hmm. Did you count them? Yeah. Could you describe some of them to us? One was, one, oh, I can't remember all of them, but I'll describe some of them. Okay. One was black. With orange stripes. Could you tell me? I mean, with how much points did I get? Black stripes. Thirty-six thousand three hundred. Um, one was orange with black stripes, and another was was a fish that spots on it glow. Oh, the, you mean the bright blue ones? Yeah. Yeah, those are great. I, and I saw a fish this day that had a, um, that had a, it was all blue and it had lights on its back. Lights on its back? Looked like lights. Looks like. Bright blue lights? Look at my poke it now. And this time, this army. This is our fish tank. Show me the crab there. There's the crab. Can you see that crab there, folks? <laughs> How about any of the hermit crabs still uh, moving, Nick? Yep, they're all back here, though. Okay, let's turn the tank around. Here's some hermit crabs, mm, folks. That didn't work.
but, but, but. Let's try to get him into focus here. There we go. See the hermit Looks pretty good in here, anyway. And the little, little fish we caught. We might eat the fish tonight. I wonder if this means that it's not in focus. We might eat those fish tonight. Boo. Uh, boo. We're going to have to let these animals go probably tonight. Uh. Okay, should I give you an introduction? Yeah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Wait a minute. Close the door. Ladies and gentlemen and children of all ages, presenting Nicholas and Tony Calenti. Come in. Oh, this is a great show, guys. Like the pelican. His mouth can hold more than his belly can. 
And he was so stupid. <laughs> Who's so stupid? Uh, Pity the pelican. <laughs> Pity the plight oh, of the pelican. But so stupid. <laughs> Together. Yeah, low battery. Yeah, low battery. Uh, let's see, if we got any battery left, let me take you on a tour of the rest of the condo since I don't think we did that. Hey, I'm Nick! Stop, Nick. Here's the one part of the Tony. There's a bulge in Tony. Yeah, let's go. It's kitchen area. Kitchen area. And bath. Period. And there's the bathroom. If you want to see the bathroom. Second bedroom. And there's my broken ankle. <laughs> I had a Here's broken the front ankle. door. Okay. So actually, if you, as you come in the condo, this is the view you get into the first bedroom. Cut it out. As you can see, today is July 29th, 1995, and I just want to take a picture of this fire that's been burning up in the Catalinas now for a week. Uh, the past uh, three or four days here in Tucson, it's been 112 to 114 degrees and uh, high winds have uh, really... Uh, made this fire get out of control. From what we're told, it's uh, right at the top on that road that goes down to the fire lookout. Let's watch that zoom again, folks. And in. This is from our backyard, of course. That is one hell of a cloud. We back up so we can see the extent of that cloud. And that's all, folks. Oh, wait a minute, Tony. I wasn't recording. I made a mistake. Okay, now tell us about Nala. Well, she's very nice. She likes to go to free. Tony, gentle, gentle with the cat. Okay, here we are, July 30th, 1995, and Tony 
is practicing his diving. I'll be right back. But, Okay, T. All right, give us a dive. A deep, a deep dive. What was it? That was a racing dive. Uh, that was pretty good. I'll give you an eight and a half on that one. Which kind of dive is this going to be? Racing. Okay. Um, yeah, it was pretty decent. I'll give you an eight on that one. Is that over ten? No. Okay. Are you going to do any more, or should I put the camera away? I'm doing more. I just need to pull out my pants. <laughs> Tony, that was excellent. That was a 10. That was a perfect... I got some over 10. I got an over 10. Oh, Rebecca. Oh, that's why I got an 11 on diving. Where, where are you, Nick? Right here. Yeah, I gave him an 11. It was just kind of fun because the perfect dive, the perfect number is only 10. But he told me he got an 11. Get out of here. Why? Just for fun. What have you been doing? Dad! Yes, Tony. Watch! Dad, watch! Playing what, Nick? What was that? Tony, jump in from the deep end and swim over to this end as fast as you can like you're in a race. I'll say ready. Anyway, swim. What? Anyway, swim. No, no, do the crawl. I'll say ready, set, go. <laughs> okay, ready? Feet together. Ready. On your mark. Get set, go. Go, Tony, go, go, go. Good job. I can uh, do it faster. You, you can do it faster than that? Yeah. Wow. I'll do it again. Ready. Just let me go. Okay, go. Anytime you want. Good job, Tony. You're wonderful. Are you ready? But we're not doing any commercial. What we're doing is uh, you were telling me why you want to come back to the condo in a month. Have you collecting? Sure. Have you been collecting this? Have you been collecting a lot of crabs so far? Yeah, but the only problem with it. What? My dad helps me. Oh, he does? Yeah. And you don't want him to? Be careful, you're going to tip over. I don't want him to. Dad, now it's my turn. The wind, the washer. What are you planning on doing with that, Nick? Where did you get that idea? Everybody else is doing it and you know it. 
Well, I know it, but I'm taking a tape, and so I figured you might want to tell the the tape where you got the idea. I got the idea. Wrong answer. Uh. Dad, okay. Let's start a Why can't you go into business? Yeah. Because, Nick, um, I don't want you to stand outside on a street corner all day trying to get people to let you wash their windows. That's why. Everybody else does it? No, not everybody else does it. There are a few people who do it because they need the money. He is crazy, and Lightning Man needs to help. You really want to help? Lightning Man is falling into a block. Nick, don't wow. hit, please. Why can't I just stand, like, like, at the corner? Not at the corner, but where people drive in and ask. You know, like where we park? Mm-hmm. Can I stand there? And ask people if they can, if you want them to wash your, if you can wash their windows for them? Yeah. No, Nick, I don't think so. Well, first of all, they, they don't speak English. They speak Spanish. So what are you going to say to them? Wait, wait, wait. That's right. That would mean, can I clean your windows? That's what that would do. So how would I say, can I clean your windows for money? How would I say that, Dad? Huh? Tell me what you've learned so far in Spanish. Which way? No. No. Today is August 6th. It's about noontime. I'm shooting this from the window of the condo. It's the estuary. And we can look straight out, see absolutely nothing except all the way down the other side of the mouth of the estuary. There's a palapa, another palapa, and some cars. That's all there is, folks. And hopefully that's all there'll ever be. Today is August 11th, 1995, as you can see. And what you're looking at here is snow, hail in the front of our house. Yesterday it was 108 degrees. Today we have hail and snow a couple inches thick uh, in our front yard. And let me give it a shot of the side yard, you'll see more. Yeah, it's like a big chunk of ice. He can't fit. He doesn't really listen. Yeah! This one is like Guys, see if you can make a snow a snowball. What? Over here. Get out of the rain, babe. What? See what? if you can make a snowball from that snow. What? Yeah, it's snow, it's a feel. Dad, you can't make a snowball with tail. Oh, cool. What's this? Oh, yeah. Ah. 
Look at this hunk of hail. Look at this hunk of hail. That's oh, not ah, <laughs> That's cold. My, my foot hurts. Look at this chunk. Let's see. Tony, hold it up to the camera. Ah, sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'll make you judge removed Lafferty of his head there, but a New York appeals court reinstated him until a decision is made regarding the estate. Hailstones. There was no autopsy. Within hours of her death, Lafferty had Duke's body cremated and reportedly... This is Tony at work. What he's doing, I have no idea, but he's been out here for about... 15 minutes now after this storm filling up the garbage pail with muddy water. Oh, looks like he's finished. Let's see what he's going to do now. Oh, is it draining the backyard? Nick, that is great. That is very pretty. I have no idea what he's doing other than filling up the garbage pail. He's going to all corners of the yard to fill up the garbage pail with water. Just turn the back light on. And now off. What are you doing, Tone? Hi. What are you doing, love? I'm going to the trash can. Why? Because I took the water from the backyard into the trash can. We're putting it there so when the water drains, when it rains, uh -huh. we're going to go it will fill up the, then we're going to save water so we can put it in, in our gardens. Great idea. You're recycling the rainwater. Well, mostly it will go away. Nick, we got to leave the trees in the fly because they help me get out. What? Why am I turning 
say there, Mr. Chin? Nothing, peoples. Don't I look great today? Mick, get, get, no, get the hands down. You don't need to do that. Don't I look great today? You look wonderful. Now, tell us a little bit about yourself, Mr. Chin. Well, see, my name's Mr. Chin because my face is upside down and my face is actually where my chin is. Is that a fact? Yes. Now, um... Who told you that, Mr. Chin? Because that is not, that is not true at all. You just happen to be a really weird-looking person. Oh, uh, I know. It's kind of weird. Mr. Chin? What? Could you sing us a song? Uh, yeah. What do you want me to sing? How about Take Me Out to the Ball Game? Take me out to the ball game. Take me out to the crowd. Buy me some peanuts and apple jacks. I don't care if you ever get back for the road. Ooh, ooh, for the home team. I don't care, it's a shame. For it's one, two, three strikes and you're out at the old ball game. Very good, mm -hmm. Mr. Chin. Now tell us a little bit about that hat you have on. Well, this hat is to protect my hair. You don't have any hair. Well, I just put it on so people don't see that I'm bald. Oh, okay. And what about your ears? I don't see any ears. Oh, um, I don't know. I don't have any ears. Now give us a big smile, Mr. Chin, because you've got a few teeth missing, don't you? Yeah. Open up. Let's have a look. Okay. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Chin. Oh. And here's your brother, Mr. Chang. Hold yes. on, let's see if we can get Mr. Chang in here. Well, hey, hello there, Mr. Chang. I know I'm not wearing a hat, but it's kind of usual. My brother, Mr. Chin, yeah. wears a hat, isn't it? And you don't wear a hat? No. Now, I think, Mr. Chang, that you learned a new song at school this week called Jumbo. All right, yes. Did you sing it for us? Can I sing my little bumblebee instead? Sure. I got the baby bumblebee. I was 
My mama is going to be so proud of me. My baby bumblebee stung me. And I squished my baby bumblebee. Wouldn't my mom be proud of me? Okay, Mr. Chang. I wiped my lips. Do you have any jokes for us? Yeah, I got one. Okay. Why is it dangerous to play cards in the jungle? I don't know. Why is it dangerous to play cards in the jungle? Because of the cheetahs. Oh! It, cheaters. <laughs> okay, see you later, Mr. Chang. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You're not going now. We're leaving. No, you never told me your name. See you, Mr. Chang Master. Bye bye. What's your. Today is September 3rd, and we're at the Children's Museum getting ready for Tony's third birthday party. His third birthday party? Tony's Six. sixth birthday party, third of this year. Kayla. I like that nip. Nice job. Kayla, show, uh, show teach your shoulder. Do your tattoo. That's good. That's good. That's really good. Let's take a look, Kayla. Bring it over here so I can I get a it. shot That's of it. Oh, your other shoulder, babe. There it is. Oh, neat. And how about that beautiful rainbow on your face? Can I see that too? Oh, beautiful. Thank you.
Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 